I'm here for another edition of Meet the Members of the National Ski Patrol. Hey, we've been all up and down the East Coast, getting ready to head west here in a little while, but we made a pit stop at Loon Mountain here in New Hampshire. And this, it seems like every time I go to a place, I say this is a cross one off your bucket list, but I tell you what, we started out in the early season in Thanksgiving where there was a barely snow on the ground, and we've got tons of snow, a big dump last night, and we're he but more importantly, we're here to get to know members of the National Ski Patrol. And our show is presented, every, every show is presented by Snow Pro Tees. My gosh, Sean Augustine down in Annapolis, Maryland in his t-shirt shop is more than happy to present the show. And it's produced by Matt G. Digital Consulting. Loon Mountain, New Hampshire. You're here with Jerry Brown. Jerry, is this paradise or what? I'll tell you what, we're doing all right. I was at a World Cup in Canada a few weeks ago. They couldn't even get off the men's event because they didn't have the snow, and we got it here at Loon Mountain. Well, there was times this year when I got off the lift and had to uh, dodge the bare spots to put my skis on. I, I don't think I can find one in 50 miles today. Jerry Brown, um, I, some say you're the legend of Loon. You've been here quite a few years. Over 30. Over 30 years. Just talk to me about... Um, 30 years, why do you keep coming back? What draws you to Loon Mountain? And more importantly, what draws you to continue to be a member of the National Ski Patrol? Well, first of all, it's a national organization all around the world. And we work in World Cups, Olympics, and other things. We've got the best training in the country to be a patrolman. And that's what it's all about. I, I've been a member for uh, since 1972. And I was a medic in the Army, and I wanted a job as a bartender. They didn't need anybody, and I liked the ski, so I've been doing it ever since. It's all about helping people. Well, I guess the good thing is you're not dodging bullets out here and like you, you were know. in the Army, but you're dodging snowflakes and, and having a good time. And, geez, 30 years. Lots of stories have built up in 30 years. Just tell me about your experience and, and how it gets better every year. Well, I, I keep working events here because it's my home area. I love Loon. Loon is the people's friendly place in New Hampshire and that's great but we're welcomed all around the world we work with the sled dogs in Canada we work with the whistler uh, weasels wow, that's good. We, we work in Russia we work in coming up in Korea so we're just doing it making it all happen now what is um you've just talked about a whole bunch of stuff that's a lot of fun working the events and all that but on a daily basis I mean we had a ton of what how much snow did you get last night uh, I think we had about 16 a total 16 well we'll take any amount of powder we can get and a big crowd out here today what was when you got out of your car this morning or thinking last night i can't wait to hit that trail oh well that's it you know it's all about the freshies <laughs> truth be known it's all about the freshies but it, it's the fun thing and a lot of people here today we're talking uh, probably 5,000 skiers here today so we'll be quite busy all day jerry what is um What's the most fun part of your everyday regular patrolling life? I mean, you get to meet a lot of people, and of, of course you, you open the mountain early in the morning and make the mountain safe, and you rescue people when they, they need help. But what is the one thing that says, wow, no, that was fun. I met a guy on the lift today, or it's just fun being out here. Well, if you're a people person, it's great because you're meeting people from all over the world. And it's so nice, and uh, it's just making a big difference. We're making a difference, and that's it. We're paying it forward by helping people out. Now, 30-plus years on the patrol, um, how does that work? How do, you, how, do you, how do you get the strength and to keep coming out and it makes you it reliving makes you your youth again, right? It makes you young. <laughs> well, we don't want to ask you how old you are, but you look pretty young to me. Yeah, I'm 67. 67 years young. <laughs> That's an inspiration to everybody out there that may be interested in becoming a member of the National Ski Patrol. My guy, my new best friend, Jerry, 67 years old, and he started over 30 years ago. So that means that's, that's, that tells me that anybody can do this. Anybody can come out if they want to ski. The training, you know, I got a son that's alive today because I had ski patrol training back in the day. So that to me, it's worth it for the rest of my life. So there you heard it. You make one difference in the world, 
and it keeps you coming back from year to year to year. If you're interested in becoming a member of the National Ski Patrol, all you got to do, folks, is check out, give a call to your local mountain, the patrol director your local mountain, or you may meet Jerry riding up the lift here at Loon. Hey, if you don't find anybody, you can't get anybody on the phone because they're out having fun, just log on to www.nsp.org, and the folks out at, at the national office will gladly point you in the right direction. Are they? Are you glad they pointed you in the right direction, Jerry? Oh, absolutely. They've been nice to me since I was a kid, first when I first came on. Now, how did you start? What? I know you said you wanted to be a bartender and you became a ski bum well, I instead. I was a medic in Vietnam, and then I wanted to get a job at a mountain, and I wanted to be a bartender. I thought that was the cool thing to do, but it was ski patrolling that grabbed me, and I've been doing it ever since. It was one of those times where you came up to ski for the day and you never left 30-plus years later? That's, that's more or less it. <laughs> Tell us about Loon Mountain. Tell us about um, what's fun out here at Loon Mountain, and uh, what can people expect when they come here to ski Loon? Well, this is Loon's 50th anniversary. It's probably the nicest ski area in all of the Northeast. Now, wait a minute. You're going to get me in trouble saying that because everyone says that. Well, I'm just telling you my, my opinion. Okay. And uh, they've got the best uh, friendly people. And that's the big part of being an employee of Loon. It's all about working with people and helping people. And that's the way it is. And they just keep conditioning to make it better. Now, the recurring theme we've had all season has been friends having fun and family and I think in the last 25 seconds you mentioned all that I think I'm trying to <laughs> I think I'm trying to we have a lot of fun here and uh, you, you know you it'll grab a hold of you for life it's a family sport you know you can ski with your family God willing for the rest of your life and that's what it's all about I got one son who was a patrolman uh, from Wachusett Mountain and he's living out at Snowbird Utah living the dream and uh, another son that raced out of here, and he's still racing out of here. So wow, there you go. Just tell me what um, what get out of the car today. What did you have to do to get ready to uh, get the snow ready? I mean, the big dump last night to get the snow ready, and the things you don't normally have to do when it's we don't get a big dump to have the people come out here, the 5,000 strong to ski here at Lynn. It's the same deal every day. We're up at five in the morning. We're here on the mountain at six, and we're here until the last thing at the night, and probably around five o'clock. That's, that's the deal every day. First on, last off, right? There you go, brother. We got some other patrollers here. Looks like they're getting ready to have some fun as well. Got their skis all racked we up. Mr. Monest, and we have Mr. Jeff Martel, our director extraordinaire. Wow, big time people here today at Loon. Well, Jerry, um, thank you. I appreciate you giving me a couple minutes of your time. You bet it. You bet it. And my guys at at uh, Snow Pro Tees, Sean Augustine, wants everyone on the show to have a gift. And we're going to give you a T-shirt, a Snow Pro T-shirt. And if you're ever, guys, if you're ever up here at Loon Mountain, check out the patrol here. Check out my guy Jerry Brown. Again, thanks a lot, Jerry. You bet. Hey, folks, right over my shoulder is Loon Mountain, one of the classic ski areas in New England and definitely one of the favorites here in New Hampshire. Again, this has been another edition of Meet the Members of the National Ski Patrol, produced by... Um, Matt G. Digital Consulting and presented by Snow Pro Tees. Hey guys, you better jump on the bandwagon. I mean, we're up and down the East Coast. We're heading out West. Jump in the truck now. There's a seat for you because Meet the Members of the National Ski Patrol is coming to a mountain near you. <laughs>